Привет, YouTube! In this video, I'm gonna do something different, something new for my channel, and it's going to be a tech review. So today I'm gonna review a gadget that I actually bought quite a while ago, but still I'm not finding any really popular tech reviews of this product on YouTube, so I decided to fill that gap. And the product that I'm holding in my hands is a pair of true wireless in-ear headphones by a French company called DVLA. This is Devil Air Gemini, and you're watching this user review and unboxing. Let's go. So first of all, a bit of history. DVLA is a French brand of a premium sound equipment that's been around on the market for about 15 years. They are known for their speakers called the Phantom, Phantom Rector. They have a couple of models, the big S one, the smaller one. They're all pretty expensive, for example, the latest Phantom speaker is around $3,000 and the sound quality of those speakers is absolutely amazing. And to buy these headphones, I actually went to the DVLA flagship store in Paris and uh, before buying these, I actually checked out their Phantom speakers. They have like a special separate room, which is closed completely from the other uh, part of the store where you can experience any speaker that they're selling. So anyways, let's do the unboxing first and see what's inside the package. It also lists here an acronym EAM, which stands for Ear Active Matching. And this is one of the many technologies that DVLA is known for because they, are, they have a lab in France where they develop proprietary tech to enhance the quality of their sound. So we'll put that technology to the test, but supposedly the way it works is, is uh, the headphones measure how snug the fit is of the headphones inside your ear canals, and then it automatically adjusts uh, the uh, sound equalization depending on like sound leakage and some, something like that. So these headphones should last you uh, around six hours, and they, inside the case, you also have four extra chargers. So. Altogether, it's up to 30 hours of listening time before you have to plug in and obviously it has USB-C charging, but it also can be charged wireless. Without further ado, let's start unboxing. And while I'm unboxing, I'm seeing uh, other features of this product. So it's using uh, Bluetooth 5 and it also uh, allows you to listen to the codex APTX and AAC, whatever that means. Uh, supposedly it's uh, the codex that provides you with the best sound quality. So in here we have some paperwork looking good, did it like here, uh, little notice, safety instructions, whatever. Let's get straight to the main product. And here we have a couple of uh, boxes on the sides. So here we have obviously the USB-C cable and here we have I assume a set of earphone, headphone tips. Let's finally check out the main product. So here it is, the case for the headphones. It's, it's pretty substantial. If I'm honest, I was expecting it to be a bit smaller. But then again, remember, this case packs four extra charges, which gives you up to 30 hours of listening time. This paper shows you how to open the case. It goes like this. Obviously it has LED light here, and there's a button to show you probably how much charge is left in there. And inside you'll see the headphones themselves. They're pretty small in size, uh, they weigh approximately 6 grams each headphone and supposedly they pack enough punch to provide you with an excellent quality of sound. What I'm noticing right away is that this top is really flimsy and this just... Uh, I wasn't expecting this in a product for, that costs 300 euros, so the price of, the, of this is quite substantial. This does not sound like a premium case. So here we are. They're quite, they're quite small actually, compared to other headphones of this format on the market. And uh, yeah, let me try these in. 
So now that I fit these in my ears, they seem to be very comfortable. The fit and finish of the headphones themselves, I'm really impressed right away with it and it's, uh, it's looking pretty good so far. So now, let's connect them to my phone and check out how they sound. Oh, and before I connect the headphones, one fun fact about these headphones. Let me show you the bag in which this small box was presented to me in the store. It's a very premium looking bag, but look at the shape of it. It doesn't really coincide with the shape of the box, so the only logical solution for this bag that I see, DVLA being a French manufacturer, it's actually a bag that you can use for your wine bottles later on. That was a joke, by the way. Just uh, to let you know, I'm listening on Tidal, on the highest quality that I have, it's called Master. And uh, yeah, let's give it a shot and uh, listen to one of the, my favorite tracks. It's called The Boss by Hermitude, Mattia and Young Taps. So far so good. The instrumentals sound really crisp and clear. I'm just waiting for the bass to kick in. Oh yes, oh, oh, oh yeah. The bass is there. It's really deep and rich, no distortions, and I'm listening on the highest volume. Sounds good! Okay, it's, uh, it's impressive, yeah. So I can definitely say that the sound quality of these TVLA Gemini headphones is top notch. So to sum up this very unprofessional uh, user review of DVLA Gemini uh, true wireless in-ear headphones, I have to say they are good value for the money. I mean, these are premium headphones, obviously, and the, the sticker price is quite steep, but nevertheless, you're getting incredible sound quality, you're getting ANC and all the proprietary technology of DVLA. Uh, it has to be seen what the quality is like, because I am a bit concerned about this flimsy uh, lid on this sliding case, but what I really enjoy about these headphones is, uh, is actually the, the fit and finish of the earbuds themselves. But what I enjoy particularly about these headphones is how unobtrusively they fit in my ear. And they don't protrude from the ear, they're not bulky. They fe it feels like I can wear them for hours without any exhaustion on my ears. And this is really important to me and probably to many users. So if you're in the market for something other than Bose, Sony's or AirPods and you're looking for some premium sound uh, and maybe it's your, uh, you want to stand out <laughs> with your headphones, I think DVLA is uh, the best option out there for you. So I hope this tech review is useful to someone who's in the market for true wireless in-ear headphones and you're looking just for some really cool and uh, option with a great sound quality. I uh, hope it doesn't break. Uh, thanks for watching this video and see you next time.